100% agree with this. It's not every parent-child relationship where the children are estranged from the parents that is a dysfunctional relationship um, where it's the parent's fault. There are as many, probably just as many um, young adults and adults who are estranged from their parents because of their choices. However, to automatically assume, like many people do, that if a parent and a child are estranged, that the child is just being stubborn or that the child is being cruel on purpose or vindictive, that's where it becomes a problem. And that's what so many people do when they hear that a parent and a child are estranged. The automatic assumption is that the child is being manipulative, vindictive, that they haven't tried everything they can think of and worked at it incredibly hard to try to fix the situation. And the reality is, in most cases that I've discussed with people, it's actually not true. Usually, an adult child finally decides they can't afford to have contact with their parent after years, years of effort, after years of trying to resolve the situation. So yeah, I this is true. I mean, there are times where the child is a narcissist or they were raised by someone who was narcissistic, right? But if the child is the problem, that does happen. However, so many cases I see, and so often when people hear about a situation like this, the assumption is that the child is the one at fault. They didn't try hard enough. And that's just heaping shame on a person who probably has already put a ton of effort into a relationship. Thanks for this comment.